Legend of the Ginseng Fairy, Part 2. Once upon a time, there was a poor little boy. He had a miserable life. He was bald and scrawny. Sounds just like me when I was Don't interrupt, Vic. Uh, yeah. I wish I was at school. Instead, I'm chopping down trees alone. Are you slacking off again? Don't beat the pigs and the cow! That's so unfair! That Mr. Lee's so mean! Poor little boy. What a miserable life. <laughs> if I were him, I'd just take off and leave. Then how would he survive with no job? You bears are free to do what you want, but we humans have to work. <laughs> As I was saying, the little boy yearned to be free, so he made himself a plan. And then... Uh... boy's bag. He couldn't have run far. Go fight him! Yes, sir! What? He ran right off the edge. Let's go! Yes, yes sir! sir. Great boy. That's it? Is the boy okay or what? It's not over yet. The next day, the little boy woke up. Huh? Huh? What's this? <laughs> hmm? Huh? How did I get up here? Huh? Oh, my leg doesn't hurt anymore. Yeah! What? I'm still alive! Yeah! <laughs> hmm? I wonder what happened to me. Yeah. I better get going now. Huh? So hungry. Oh yeah. Why didn't I think of this before? Um yum yum. Um yum 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 yum. Um yum. Huh? Mr. Lee! <laughs> How come you don't have a scratch on you? I saw you fall down that slope. You better tell me the truth. Well? Well, I had a dream and I saw a fairy. She came out of nowhere and helped me. Then I fell asleep. You say a fairy, huh? I've heard of stories about a ginseng fairy who helped wounded people in the woods. Maybe, maybe if you can take me to this fairy, I will give you lots of food and you won't have to work anymore. How about that, huh? What do you say? No way! I won't betray the fairy! Then you've made your choice! You'll be locked in here until you tell me where that fairy is! Fairy, you better get out of here! They'll catch you! 
Oh, I see. Don't worry. Huh? Why are we here? Well, we're far from your captors. You're free. Really? Oh, thank you, Fairy. It's my pleasure. Here, take this. Oh, uh, whoa! Hey, Fairy! Huh? Fairy? Dear boy, you can go to school now with this ruby. I hope that you study hard and become a wise, kind-hearted man. Remember, you can control your destiny. Fairy? I'll do as you wish and study hard! The ginseng fairy is such a great and wise woman. It's so sweet. Blogger Vic, you can't seriously uh, still uh. be thinking of catching her. Oh, thank you! Your stories have inspired me! Well... Prior. Eh, maybe we shouldn't have told him anything. He still doesn't get it, does he? Come on, let's go check on him. Okay. Oh, she ain't here either. When I finally find that fairy, I'm gonna be rich. <laughs> I won't need to work for that stingy boss of mine anymore. Ginseng fairy, where are you? I'm gonna find that fairy. Ginseng fairy, ginseng fairy. Where are you, Ginseng Fairy? Bro, we gotta think of something. He's gonna destroy the whole forest. Well, now he's got fairy tales rolling around in his head. There's nothing we can do. I hoped he would learn something, but that didn't exactly work out, did it, bro? Uh, uh, oh. If only the Ginseng Fairy were here to help us now. Don't be silly. The Ginseng Fairy isn't real. Huh? Huh? That's it! Bramble, you're a genius! I am? Why do you say that? Here's what we'll do. <sighs> I am exhausted. I've been digging all day long. And nothing. Huh? Maybe they were fooling. Hello, Hello Vic. Vic! We are the Ginseng Sisters! <laughs> Do my eyes deceive me? Do you think he recognizes us? No, I don't think so, bro. <laughs> I finally found you! Ooh. Great ginseng fairy, please can you help me? I have a bad life, I'm very poor. And my boss is such a stingy man. If you could give me some gold or rubies, I'd be so grateful. <laughs> he doesn't, he doesn't know. know. Uh, Logger Vic, we don't have any gold or rubies here. What? Uh, let me see here. Do you have some thousand-year-old ginseng or something like that, maybe? Yes! We could give you some valuables, but you have to help us first. Uh-huh. <laughs> well, uh, I didn't know fairies bargain. As long as you stop cutting down trees and burning the forest, we have a deal! That's fair, okay, uh-huh. I'm never gonna have to cut down trees again. <laughs> <laughs> and then we'll give you a <laughs> thousand-year-old ginseng. <laughs> now remember... You keep your end of the deal. Oh, this doesn't look like ginseng to me. Uh, uh, <laughs> of course it's ginseng. It all looks like that. Right, Bramble? Uh, uh, uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> well, you've got your ginseng. We better be going. Hold on. <laughs> Why is that ginseng fairy called Bramble? This could be a trick. Won't you come in? I've got iced honey inside. Oh, sure, oh yeah! <laughs> honey is my favorite! <sighs> oh wait, I'm a fairy now. I guess the ginseng fairy doesn't eat honey. Thanks, but I think I'll pass. Okay, get out of here! You oh, run for terrible. it, Bramble! Uh, uh, bro, wait for me! Stop! You lie to me! You're so mean! We didn't lie to you! The stories are true! Then where is she? Tell me how to find her! <laughs> the ginseng fairy is not real! I should have known all along, you liar! But the legend exists! Yeah? Who's calling me in the middle of the night? Let it be me! Where's my ginseng? Ginseng? I haven't got any ginseng! Uh, hey boss? Yes, Victor, I'm here. 
And you're there! And you're fired! Wait, Busley. Not again. Wise Yoga Master. <laughs> Come on, Slowpoke! <laughs> Huh? I can still smell you even if I can't see you. <laughs> <laughs> that bramble sometimes he's just too easy. Huh? What is that? Ah, gotcha! <laughs> I win! Ah, great job. You win! Absolutely! <laughs> bramble, look over there. Huh? Whoa! What? What's all that about? You think they're frozen? It's too hot. Let's go look. Uh, oh. Sire, how long do I have to maintain this pasture? We only be posing one minute. Keep going. Hello. Uh -huh. What you up to? <laughs> wow, he's standing so still. Uh -huh. <laughs> Don't do that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's not nice. Can't you see I'm practicing? <laughs> Huh? Practicing? Is this some kind of new game? Mm. Oh, contraire. This is not being childish. Huh. Tiki, will you just get to the point? Oh? <coughs> so, we be practicing a very powerful form of kung fu. Yeah, that's right. We learned it from a magazine we saw in the dumpster next to the bushes on the east side of the railway station. What, what does, does it say? say? <laughs> oh, it is far too powerful for you. This practice comes from India. A very sophisticated sport. Oh, you are such a bother. Oh. Wow, what's this amazing form of Kung Fu called? Huh? It is called the legendary yoga. Yogurt? Ooh, that sounds yummy, bro. No, it's yoga. Once you master it, you can do all sorts of things. Look at me. I can lick my own nose. That is not funny. <laughs> Don't listen to him. If you be doing the yoga, your mind and body get stronger. Like this big boy. Oh, that's, that's awesome. awesome! I can practice it to keep fit and slim and get back in the shape. Huh. Please, Please teach, teach us, great monkey master. master. Oh, I be teaching you well. But it not be free. <laughs> oh, yeah. Woo. It's just like Tiki said, yoga really is great. Yeah, it's working wonders. Oh, by the way, it's pretty quiet in the forest these days. I feel like something's missing. Hmm. Yeah, I think I know what you mean. What's it's longer, Vic. It's been a long time since he cut wood. Oh, I wonder what that's all about. Bro, maybe he quit. <sighs> And would that be such a bad thing? Come on, who cares where he's at? Let's just enjoy it. Mm, I guess that makes sense. <laughs> Ooh? Oh. What was that? Fire! Huh? <clears throat> Fabian, what are you doing here? Well, um, it's a long story. Really? You transferred all the money into my account? <sighs> and a one-month vacation? I must be dreaming. Oh, ouch. <laughs> oh my, it is real. Yeah! I got paid! And I get a vacation! <laughs> hey, Fabian, guess what? Bossley just gave me two months' salary and a month off. I'm gonna have so much rest. <sighs> this ought to last me a few weeks. <laughs> what a hilarious chicken he is! <laughs> Fabian, go get me some more potato chips, would ya? <laughs> Thanks, buddy. <laughs> hey, Fabian, could ya? 
Grab me some more OJ. Yeah. Hey, grab me an apple too, please. I'm so totally relaxed after today. <sighs> Fabian, turn on the television. <coughs> Fabian, get me another drink. <coughs> Fabian, come here and open this bag of potato chips. <coughs> Fabian, help me put on my slippers. <coughs> Fabian, Fabian. <coughs> <laughs> oh, I love this guy, Jim. Huh? <laughs> this guy is so funny. <laughs> Go away, I'm busy. I came out to hunt for some food. How did Longer Vic become so gluttonous and lazy? <sighs> if he keeps eating I his junk food, Longer Vic's going to ruin his health. Bram, let's go. Just look at that belly. Briar, I love snacks, but that's just not healthy. Trust me, bro, I know. Come on, we better help him lose weight. Um, hmm. Hey. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> 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 yeah. <laughs> I'm not going to let you ruin this for me. Right here. Come on, bald man. How dare you say that? Stop. Lagervik, why are you sitting down? Bro, remember that time Tiki gained a bunch of weight too fast? Yeah, that's right. He ate too many bananas, then he suffered from dizziness, chest pains, high blood pressure. Yeah, he was pretty messed up. Oh, the poor guy. Fortunately, he practiced yoga with us. Mm. Since he started to do that, he's felt like a million bucks. You won't believe it. You know, now he's just as quick and nimble as Warren. <laughs> oh, man. Excuse me, Briar? Huh? Who? Flogger Vic, what do you want? <laughs> Maybe you both could teach me some of that yoga, eh? Mm -hmm. Of, of course. course. Flogger Vic, do as I do. <laughs> 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 All right, Vic, follow me. Come on. Just a little bit longer. Great. So much healthier. I want to thank you, Two Bears. Thank you so much. <laughs> no sweat. Our pleasure. Oh, that's very nice of y'all. Uh, Victor! Oh, hi there, Boss Lee. How you doing? <laughs> Vacation time's over. Now get your butt back in your gear! I'll get back to work right away, sir. Thanks a lot, Boss. Bye! <laughs> See ya!
time to cut some trees. Bye, bye, Nick. Bye. Huh? Wait, cut trees? Ah! <gasps> Frog and Frog Nick, wait! Hold it right there! Angry Bird. I think I lost him. <laughs> Baby, what a fine tree. And I'm all alone with no bears in sight. Mm -hmm. ah, here we go. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> Hello, Birdie. Oh, hey. Oh, wise guy. Go away, Bird. Can't you see I'm busy here? That's not fair! Just look what you did to my pants! Huh? Oh. Cut it out! Oh. That's enough. You're going to leave me alone. Pesky bird. Now, where was I? What happened? I'll be. Logar Vic? I guess today's not my day. Oh. <laughs> it's been nice seeing you. I gotta go though. Bye. <laughs> I won't allow you to keep destroying the forest! I better not see you out here again! Huh? Another one down. Oh man, I was too late. What's this? It looks like Lagervik's hat. Oh, and an egg! Wait a second. I gotta go find the mama bird and fast. Come on, hoo hoo. You gotta help me, please. Come on, do it for me. Sorry, pal. I just can't help you with this. I'm not ready to be a mother. But hoo hoo, I can't find its real mother. You know you can do it. Just give it a try. Uh, uh, um, but the thing is, I don't really know how to hatch eggs, Bramble. Huh? That's easy. You just hug the egg real close like it was your best friend. Huh? Sorry, Bramble, but I can't be seen sitting on an egg. Ugh, see you later. Oh man, what am I going to do now? You poor little thing. I need to think of a way to persuade Hoo Hoo. La 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 la. Hoo Hoo, wait! Huh? <laughs> Bramble! Ah! Huh. Hoo -hoo, please Bramble, help seriously, me. stop Hoo -hoo. following me, okay? Uh, Bramble, go away! Leave me alone! Uh, uh, I'm exhausted. <sighs> huh? Huh? Oh? Uh. Wow! Oh, look at him! He's so cute and little and tiny! 
<laughs> what? You want to be its dad? <laughs> but... But you can't. Oh, but bro, look at it. Ain't he cute? Uh, hey, look. Huh? Come on. I couldn't find the mama bird anywhere, bro. <sighs> All right. This will be his home. How can I say no to that face? Hello. <laughs> He's staying. Yeah. <laughs> it must be hungry. Yeah. Why don't you go out and find some food? Okay. <laughs> Let's go. I see no bears. Alrighty. Let's go. <laughs> Sorry, dude. Too slow. <laughs> it's time for your din din. Come on. Open up. What's that? That's Logger Dick's chainsaw. Oh. <laughs> It's you. Come back for more of the same, have you? <laughs> no, leave me alone, you stupid bird. Go away. Leave me alone. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you can't get through my safety hail man. Too bad, bird. Ah! My hard hat. Give it back to me. Huh? <laughs> oh, somebody help me! Huh? <laughs> what did he do this time? Let's go. Come on. Oh, save me! <laughs> oh! <laughs> That's that taken care of. You can't outwit Logger Vic. Uh huh. It's a bit quiet. Huh? It could have flown away. Huh. Hold on here. Oh! Oh no! Oh, the window! Ah! Ah! I have a weapon, and I'm not afraid of you, Dad! Uh-oh. Come on, you! Go and dispatch that bird! Oh, I'm safe now. Baby, get off of me! What's going on? You having a party? Order, Vic! Oh, get off of me! Get off of me! <laughs> Logger Vic, you know what you did? You went and chopped down these birds' home tree, and that's why you were attacked. Oh, I didn't know that. Vic, you too, Fabian. You owe them both an apology. Oh, I'm sorry. Really, I am. I'll take you back home. I think you'll like it. You know what? I built it super special for you. Hmm. The mama bird and the baby bird together again. It's <laughs> <laughs> so sweet. <laughs> hmm? <Yeah. laughs> 
Um, hey, Drake. Oh. Do you want some honey? Uh, okay. <laughs> Follow me. <laughs> Uncle Drake, you gotta stop chopping down animals' homes. Oh, I will. I promise. Shooting Contest, Part 2. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> Ladies... Huh? Uh, Ladies... <laughs> come on. Ladies and gentlemen, are you ready? Rumble! Rumble! Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! I'm so gonna win this game and get that wonderful honey. Contestants, are you ready to begin? Rumble! Rumble! Huh? Uh, uh, what are you doing? It's not a race. <clears throat> All right. Before we begin, the contestants will say a few words. Uh, uh, All right, Vic, let go. Huh? Hey, it's my turn. No, no you let go. <laughs> you let go. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Bramble. Locker Vic. Take this! Yup! Yeah. <laughs> huh? uh. I won! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> See, I told you. You can't beat me, you dumb bear. <laughs> you go first, then. <laughs> huh? <laughs> I will defeat Vic in the game for sure! I won't let you guys go! <laughs> That's not entirely fair! Go, Bramble! You can do you, it! You, you can do it, Bramble! Fine, let's just do this. We'll see who has the last laugh, Bear. <clears throat> and now, I will explain the rules. In front of each contestant is a row of ten <laughs> apples. Whoever hits all their apples first wins the game. Okay, contestants, on your marks. Whoa. Whoa. Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> Thank you, you guys. Something funny. I know how to warm up too, you know. I'm well prepared. Huh? <coughs> Contestants are ready? I'm ready. I'm readier. Mm -hmm. Logovic, what a man. Just look at him. He's smiling with confidence because he knows he can shoot. I bet he'll win. Oh, <laughs> don't count Bramble out. He doesn't seem nervous, and his aim is steady. Ready? <gasps> Logovic fires a bullet like a champion. Alas, he missed entirely. Ah, looks like Bramble missed too, though. Huh? Bramble shot was closer, at least. Vic's shot wasn't even close. Well, both of them missed. At least Vic looked confident oh, doing yeah. it. However, Bramble, yeah. not so much. <laughs> it's a shooting contest, not a modeling match. Ha, you see? This round, Bramble looks more handsome. Compared to what? Look there. Bramble's way closer to the target. Vic is close, too. <laughs> Well, so far, both contestants have taken ten shots each and missed every single one. Now we need some kind of tiebreaker. And when that happens, I'm guessing Bramble will surely lose the game. Well, pardon me for saying, but your opinion is probably wrong. Wait and see. All right, all right, all right. Us commentators have deserved a break. Come on, Fabian. Let's go. Meow. <sighs> Bramble, uh, oh. have some water. Oh, <laughs> thanks a lot, Babu. <laughs> I'll give you a massage. <laughs> Silly, I don't need that. <laughs> oh, <laughs> thank you, Fabian. Good cat. <laughs> Here, I'll give you a massage, too. It's easy. So easy. You think this is easy? Yes, I can do that too. I know what you said. A relaxing massage. Ow. All right, the break is over. And it looks like our contestants are ready. Our battle is about to commence. 
Vic seems to be in high spirits. Bramble still looks very much at ease, exuding confidence like I knew he would. Oh. <laughs> Bramble! Hey, Bramble! Huh? Come over here a second. Come here. Uh. Huh? What is it, Babu? Bramble, your aim is too low. That's why all your shots are hitting the ground way too soon. Aim high! <laughs> That bear shouldn't listen to Babu. Hey, huh? are we going to do this or what? Remember. <laughs> I'll try it. <laughs> Ready? Begin. Oh. Huh? <laughs> and Vic fires a shot. It'll hit the target for sure. But alas, he aimed too high. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. Vic has now hit eight apples. One, Looks like two, he's going to take the win. Huh? Ha! Check it. Bramble hit eight apples too. Bramble had four bullets left. And Vicky has... Well, he is also having four bullets left. Looks yeah, like a tied yeah, game. Yeah. Whoever hits the last two Come apples on, first Bramble. wins the game. Yeah, if I had to bet, I'd say Bramble wins yeah. it. Confident, he be. Let's see how long you can keep that smile. Hey, little squirrel, huh? give us a hula dance. Woo, 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 woo. My dance club? No way. Come on, don't you want some pine nuts? Huh? Huh? Pine nuts? Okay, I will dance. Huh? 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 I'll do anything for a pie nuts. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Go ahead. Uh, you afraid of something? Uh, we don't have all day. No, no distractions. Uh, another. What? Oh, bad. Uh, uh, uh. Huh? Yeah. So, Bramble, not so confident, eh? You've only got three more bullets left. Try not to be distracted. Logger, Vic, you sneaky fox. I'll take that compliment, but you can't blame me. Hm. Pie dots. <laughs> Warren, what's going on? Focus, Bramble, focus. Huh? Again? Oh, yo, oh, Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's too funny, huh? Uh, uh, Ramble missed again. Uh, oh, no. Uh. Mm, thanks, Warren. Terrific dance. You made him dance? How am I supposed to focus? He was just expressing his support for you. <clears throat> you didn't like it? Why, you little... Highlands <laughs> isn't the best way to solve our problems. Let go. <laughs> I only uh, have two bullets uh, left. I gotta do this. Uh, my turn now. Yay! Only one left! Do, 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 do. Bramble must hit both remaining apples to win. <laughs> that won't be easy. Bramble trained to win, and he will. If Bramble wins, I'll get the pine nuts. Oh, but he's probably gonna lose. Vic said he would give me pie nuts if he won the game, but I don't think Vic is very reliable. To make sure, I'll just ask Vic to give me the pie nuts for the dances. I can do this. Yeah! Awesome! This is the last apple. Whoever makes this final <laughs> shot wins. Don't be too excited. Bramble is down to one. However, Vic still has three. <laughs> Ready? Bramble's gonna lose if he misses one more time. Mama huh? Vic, give me my pine nuts for that death. Go away, kid. You bother me. Bramble wins! Bramble wins! I keep my promises. Here, 
So much for my hometown pine nuts. Logger Vic, <laughs> even though you tried to cheat, we still had a pretty good time. So here, uh, you can have some special uh, honey. Really? Smells really good. <laughs> oh yeah, I'll send this to my dear old mom. Logger Vic's lottery. Number 15. 15, come on! The first winning number is... 15. 15. 15! Whoa! 15! Yeah! I got one. Okay, next. And now we have the second number. 24. 24! Come on, 24! It's coming out. It's 24! Oh, wow. I got the first two numbers. There's only one left to go. If I get all the numbers, I'll get a big jackpot! <laughs> 18. 18. Come on, Eddie! And here comes the last one. Make it so. Isn't this exciting? What will it be? And the last number is... 18! Uh, but For those who missed it, here again. 18. I can't believe it. The winning numbers uh, are 15, uh, I'm okay. 24, uh, and 18. It is true! Yay! <laughs> Wait a second. I shouldn't be wasting time. I better cash it in now! How to spend the money. Um... As like always, family first. I'll give my parents half of it. And I'll take the other half and live happily ever after. Gotta get myself a limo. Ooh, uh. But first, I'm gonna quit this job. Uh, then I'll take over the company. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Who could be calling me now? Hello there. Vic speaking. Are you slacking uh, off or what, Logger Vic? Boss Lee? Who else calls you, you nincompoop? Boss Lee's never called this late before. Are you still there? Vector! Vector! Uh, I'm here, yeah. Listen, Vic, it's almost the middle of the year, so I'm coming over to check your progress. Huh? And you'd better be ready for me, because I'll be there tomorrow. Uh, Vic? Huh? Vic, are you listening to me? Uh, Boss Lee, that won't be necessary. I'll see you tomorrow. Wait, hey, boss? Why is he coming? I don't get it. Did he find out about the lottery ticket? Dang it. Uh, uh, uh. <sighs> I really got to get this back to my place. What's Logger Vic doing up? Is he chopping down the trees while we're asleep? Gotta check this out. Ah, uh, the bushes are no good either. What am I gonna do? I have to hide it tonight. Or the boss will take it for himself. Oh? This is just disastrously complicated. Yoink! Ooh! Logger uh, Vic? Uh, but Briar... You're logging at night now? Uh, no I'm not. I wouldn't do that. Briar, please may I have that note in your hand back? Huh? Oh, this note? Why does it make you so nervous? But it doesn't. I'm not acting nervous. <laughs> what is this thing? Uh, hey, be careful with that ticket. I need it. It's a jackpot. I just won the super lottery, but I've got to hide it because my boss is coming. Say what? <laughs> With that ticket, I don't have to work anymore. However, if I can't take the ticket to the lottery, I'll just have to keep logging. So you're telling me, if you hide this piece of paper, you're done logging for good? That's right. Once I'm a rich man, I won't need to log anymore. All right. You can hide the ticket in my house. After your boss leaves, you'll come get it. If it's good for the forest, I'm in. <gasps> oh, thanks. Do you mean it? Sure thing. <laughs> ah, wonderful. <sighs> At least someone's sleeping. All right, let's hide mm -hmm. this bad boy. Ah, but where to put it? Hey, this basket! Just remember where we put it. And when your boss is long gone, it'll be right here. Briar, uh, I owe you big time for this. 
Uh, okay. Uh, no problem. It's getting late. I've got to get home. Thanks for everything. Bye-bye. <sighs> Time for some shut-eye. Oh. <sighs> oh, poor Tommy. I almost forgot that Briar found some food for me. Oh. <laughs> Did he eat all of it? Oh. Huh? What's this thing? Oh. I guess I gotta go find my own food. Thank goodness the boss is gone. I'm gonna fetch my ticket and cash it. Yay! <laughs> Briar, Briar! Hey, hey! My boss is gone! I'm here to pick up the lottery ticket. You know, the one you hid for me. Uh huh? Oh, Vic, it's you. Yeah, it's over there in that basket. Get it yourself. Ah! <laughs> oh. Uh. Briar! Briar, wake up! The basket is empty! Briar! Where is it? Good afternoon, everyone. Welcome to live news. There goes my Let's chair. Watch the first <laughs> I'm such a loser. <laughs> Headmaster Jang of Pine Tree Mountain Primary School told the reporter that an anonymous person donated the winning lottery ticket to a disadvantaged uh? school. This That's my lottery time, ticket. Teachers and students uh. needed most. The school's resources are out of date, and with this donation, they will give the student body a richer environment to learn in. When asked to comment, Mr. Jang was speechless. Uh -huh. A representative from the school told us that every bit of the money would oh, go towards well, the rich student body. But I have a house, a this job, and a truck. Breaking I guess I'm happy Weather with my next. life. Hmm. They deserve it. Mama's boy! Lord of Vic's gone too far. At this rate, he'll chop the whole forest down. We can't let him. But Bramble, we can't keep chasing him. We need to stop him for good. Help me! 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 Somebody help me! Help! Bramble, we gotta go save him! Please help me! What's wrong with Logger Vic? I got it! He just needs a little of the old CPR! Hang on, Logger Vic! You can count on Bramble! Hook her up, big guy! Gotcha! I got it! Mama. Take care of yourself when you're away from home. Mama, don't leave me. Please don't leave me. I miss you. Bro, so what's the matter with him, huh? His cheeks look just like tomatoes. Let me check. Ooh, he's running so hot. I think he has a fever. A fever? Mama. Oh. I'm sorry, I don't know. He's running a high fever. We have to help him. Find some medicine or something. Let's split up and look. Oh. Huh? Logger Vic, where are you going? Hey, where's he going, bro? He's so sick, he must be hallucinating. Go, let's check it out. Oh. Water. Cat 
Huh? Oh, he looks really sick. I'm worried about him. There's nothing even in this kettle. If we weren't here with him, the house would have burned down. While he's sick, we better keep an eye on him and keep him safe. We don't want him to get any worse. Yeah. Boil some water in this kettle. I'll watch Vic. Mm -hmm. Calm down. You don't wear shoes. We have to find Vic. <laughs> Boys and girls, when you're at home alone, please remember, stay away from boiling water. It's Bramble, hot. get over here. Coming. Huh? Get over here and get him off me. Vicky, sweetie, you are my pride and joy. I'll go now. Have a good rest, my darling. Mm -mm. Please don't go. Hold it. Oh, no, is he now? I'm so cold. Bro, he looks cold like that. Hmm. Let's cover him with the quilt. No. Huh? Please don't. Please don't go. I'm so cold. Vic, I am not your mama. Briar, just give him a hug, bro. Just look at how happy he is. <sighs> Bramble? Huh? We'll find some more porridge for him. He needs his strength. I must be really hard to log a deep spot. Hold your horses! What a crybaby. Apple slices, Vic. Will you stop being oh, such a spoiled now. brat? <laughs> I am not your mother! <laughs> your apples. <laughs> Just right. <laughs> oh, there's a good boy. <sighs> Please cut them even smaller. What? Logger Vic, are you kidding me? Uh, calm down, bro. He's really sick. Do you like the apples? Mama cut the apples just right. <laughs> oh, sweetie, honey, you are my good boy. Logger uh, Vic must be uh, dreaming of his mama. Uh, He's smiling uh, so sweet. Uh, <laughs> Uh-oh. Hey. Uh, that's not how my mama smells. No. Uh -huh. No. No. Briar, what should we do now, bro? All right, fine. Just hand him here. Mama. You're not my mama. My mama smells like lovely rice. Like rice? Hello, mama. How do I smell like rice? Got it. There, there, Logger Vic. Your mom will be right back. Just take a nap. That's a good boy. Ah. Huh? Huh? Hey! Bro, what you doing? You got me all wet. Bro, why are you smelling me? <sighs> you smell like rice. Just like rice. Come on. <laughs> Don't ask me why. Just wait and see what Vic does. does work. That's not enough. If he eats rice porridge full of mother's love, he will recover soon. Wow. This looks great. Ooh, hot, 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 hot. <laughs> Logger Vic, wake up. Have some porridge here. Now, that is my oh, mom's wait porridge. Wait a minute, it's hot. <laughs> Give it to me. <laughs> 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 Come on! Oh, Sunny, open your mouth! Gee, mm. it sure is the flavor of home. Oh, sweeter than anyone else. She's the best. No one can compare to my mom. <laughs> 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 Uh, oh, open it. Mm, that's good. <laughs> oh, brother. Here we go again. Thanks, Ma. Mm. You're the best, Ma. Mm. It's not easy being Logger Vic's mom. Hey, the fever is gone. <sighs> now let's go home and get some sleep.
Let's go. <laughs> Briar, if Longer Vic is completely recovered and goes logging tomorrow, what should we do? We have no choice. We'll have to stop him. But today... Today, he was our patient. So you're not angry? We always take care of our patients. Ugh. Ugh. Such a great night's sleep. Dreaming about my mama, the best thing ever. That's it! I think today I'll call mommy. <laughs> Once upon a time, part two. <laughs> Stop there! Oh, catch me if you can. <laughs> Stop! <laughs> My king, I'll come save you! You don't stand a chance! I have the bud now! Uh, hurry! We've got to get it back! <laughs> Jumping cat, attack! <laughs> <laughs> Nicely done! <laughs> <laughs> I will not let you get it! Wow! <laughs> that was close! Wow! <laughs> <laughs> You'll never get me now! <laughs> Is there delicious honey inside the bud? <laughs> <laughs> well, you keep quiet during story time. Yeah. Oh, oh, okay. My bad. I'm sorry. But why do they all want the bud? Because the bud contains the secret for defeating the king. <laughs> <sighs> the Dark King took the bud, and our queen is still asleep. Guardians, will our queen be sleeping like this forever and ever? What are we gonna do? Huh? huh? Right. We can go seek help. But seek, seek help, help where? where? <laughs> Greetings. <laughs> is the spirit elder home? It is very urgent. You mean, he isn't home? He is home, but, uh, he... Uh, 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 Elder! Elder! Hello, mister, would you please wake up? Our forest is in danger now! Please wake up! Wake up, wake up! Huh? He's away! <laughs> so gross! <laughs> Guardian Briar, do you think we can really count on him? I doubt it. He doesn't look very wise to me. He's already gone back to sleep. Okay. Mm -hmm. We have to find another way. Hmm. <clears throat> uh -huh. <laughs> you need to relaxing. Now stop stressing. Yeah. You do what I do. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> what is he doing? How can he dance right now? Hey! Relax! What is he doing with me? Huh? Huh? Elder! Uh, our forest is in danger now! Your anxiety is not solving any problems. I am wanting to make your heart peaceful. The only way to the truth. And the future. Future? future? Go ahead. And getting the bud back. I'll be waiting at the palace. Sir! <laughs> Look! Here it is! Ah. So this is the entrance to the Dark Kingdom. Ready? <laughs> okay. Now listen, we have to retrieve that bud. Let's go! Your Majesty, the Spirit Queen left this bud behind. I'm sure it's full of all her powers. I'm not sure. It looks like a pretty normal bud to me. I saw it with my own two eyes. The Spirit Queen poured all of her powers into it. Aww. I'll examine it closely. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> what can you see? Shh. We better split into teams. I'll go distract the Dark King, 
You two go get the bud, and then we meet right back here. Get out quick. <laughs> Hello, Dark King. I'm here for the bud. The bear, Guardian. You are not permitted to enter my palace. Jumping Cat, go get yeah. him! Oh no, we've been seen. Let's go. Leave the bud where I can see it. I'll deal with this. Get going. <laughs> Be careful. Well, that was easy. I better run. I did it. <laughs> and Guardian Briar? Uh, well, um, he's still in there. We gotta go save him right now. <laughs> Guardian Briar, we're here to save you. I'm okay. Just go. Get the butt back to the forest. <laughs> no way. We can't just leave here without you. The Elder is waiting for that bud to save the whole forest. Just go! No! No one's leaving the palace. Guardian Briar? Bram, let's go. We gotta take it to the Elder before it's too late. Right. <laughs> Hurry. <laughs> <laughs> Elder, we brought the bud for you. Good. I know you're being successful. Um, where's Guardian Briar? Guardian Briar, to cover for us, he's still fighting the Dark King. Hmm. I know he'll be back here soon. Elder, here, the bud. Okay, let's be doing this thing. Placing it here. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Do night when the moon rise. And it is most bullet. All its power will go to the bud. And it will blossom, making the Whoa. forest bursting with life again. Ah. Ah. <laughs> oh no, it is a ducking. Ah, I finally escaped the Guardian. Without moonlight, how will your bud blossom? He's blocking the moon. Huh? Gotta be the time! Sir! Huh? <laughs> Waiting for it. Fire! Yeah. Yeah. That old trick, eh? <laughs> <laughs> your majesty is amazing. <laughs> now you got, hey? Ah, oh, come on. Mm, that's it. Mm. Ah. 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 Come on. <laughs> Wah, oh, yeah. What? Jumping cat, go get the bud. Wah. Oh, oh, no. Saving the queen and the bud. <laughs> yeah. Tight. Let him go! You'll never beat me! <laughs> it's mine now! Oh, oh my! <laughs> Thought you'd escaped me, did ya? <laughs> yeah! It's Guardian Briar! Way to go, Guardian Briar! I can't believe this! You! Release me at once! Ready? Holding steady! I'm on it! Fire! Yeah! Guardian Briar! Your Majesty! Oh, my King! <laughs> okay, fine. Fine then. You win. <laughs> Hey. It's good to have you back. Thanks for saving me and for saving the whole forest. Thank you so much, my guardian. The forest is alive again. <laughs> and so, harmony was restored once again.
And the animals lived happily ever after. Yeah! <laughs> a happy ending! I was hoping that the bud contained lots and lots of honey. <laughs> Ramble. <laughs> Story time's over. Let's all head to bed. Uh, I'm tired. Uh, uh, but yeah. I want to hear more. I Try can't sleep on me. such a full tummy. <laughs> what an awesome story. <laughs> Those bears finally came in handy for something. <laughs> <laughs>